Well, hello, hello, everybody. That horn is calling it episode 10. Transport Fever, Vanilla Hills, Monty here, Monty plays games. Uh, yeah, we got a lot going on this episode. Uh, first and foremost, we have, and what, however you say, whatever. Uh, anyway, the steel eel upgrades are happening. We're going to be moving on up to the Axalp. That's right, A-X-A-L-P, Axalp, however, you know, however you want to say it is cool by me. But that's going to be the upgrade happening. More going on in Portland uh, this ep episode, which has been the kind of focal point city. Uh, we have construction materials, which we're getting by trucks. I want to bring that in by trains. And I want to transfer by train also those construction materials over to Akron, which is a little bit south of Portland, while also bringing goods on that train. So a little mixed usage there. San Antonio is also going to need a lot of upgrades. Uh, I want to bring in, I do believe, three passenger lines. Look at that beautiful train rolling off in the background. As we're about to get the ship upgrade, there is the axle. Let's go ahead and get a closer look. Because one of the annoying buttons up top has been, uh, hey, uh, the steel mill wants to ship more steel. Man, this is a beautiful view. And uh, thanks again, Robbie, for getting my uh, logo in the game. Look at that. With the train in the distance. Oh. Oh, transport fever. You know what? I guess I don't need transport fever, too. I'm happy. You guys don't... You don't even need to come out with it. I'm, I'm good. <laughs> I'll do the anti... I'll be the anti-hype, even though I'm so hyped. Very excited for transport fever, too. Right around the corner. That's why we're still here in the Vanilla Hills. And uh, I am loving it. So let's let's hit that intro and let's get to going this episode. And uh, thanks again for joining me. Make sure you're leaving comments and uh, all the all the stuffs. Catch you in a second. Alrighty, that seconds has gone by, and here we are. Uh, made a change. Instead of going down to Portland first, I just hit up San Antone on our way. I've already upgraded the bus tram system uh, as far as the stop that does connect into the brand new station. And look at that, it even has a mist fountain, a misty, misty fountain. Uh, not a misty mountain, so no dragons here. Anyway, so this is what's, we've got loops, we've got things happening so trains cannot do magical turnarounds. And San Antonio needs to move up to Madison. Oh, look at this. I have a little puzzle piece to connect here and a little puzzle piece. You guys know me. And uh, the other way, which is nice, is we're going to have this connect to Portland. So this is how we're going to connect to Portland. This is all new. Uh, passenger line here and then a passenger line up to Mobile. So now instead of just getting this line from Portland, Mobile's going to be getting a line from good old San Antonio. So you can go check out the Alamo if you wish, if you please. Uh, oh my. So I did some tree detailing just because having blocks of factories just sporadically through your town. It's, it's eh. This needs to be fixed. Little things that we notice as we go. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's get these passenger lines built out after we watch this train go on by. Oh yeah. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell the trains. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's head on back. Get a train a rolling. Let's uh, get out of this Alt G no UI mode. Lockheed Super Constellation, very nice, and a new stake car. That's gonna come in handy. High speed track, cause we go faster, we go home. Is how we play here. Nice. It's going to let me double this. A little bit of an awkward turn there, but I kind of like a little bit of awkwardness in my life. Uh, there we go there. Connect the dots. And I didn't want... Uh, no, calm down. You always sneak... Find your way to sneak in to my episode. We are not going to go electric. You need to calm down. Anywhere that's green is going to go red. There we go. And uh, that is now connected. All I need is a few signals here. Another beautiful ship view there, but we're going to have to just keep on keeping on here. Uh, yeah, I'm going to put one here. 
and here. Cool, so the train comes in this way, hits up the station, turns around, and leaves. And we're going to have two lines hitting up this outer platform. So let's continue on over here. This is going to be a single line. And yes, keep that red. I like that it matches the rest of the bridge that's already there. I'll do my cleaning up post-episode when I'm rocking out. All right, let's keep on going here. I don't want to slow down too much, guys. But uh, sometimes we just got to do what we got to do. 240, acceptable. Ooh, not nothing under 200, guys. Oh, I see that sneaking in over here. Okay, so I have ideas. Sorry, guys. Boom, boom, boom. Sorry, that might be a little extreme. Extreme deleting. All right, get, get yourself over here. Meet the road. Whoa, that's the exact opposite of what I need from you. So let's go this way. Maybe a little bit of. Uh, why do you keep one thing to do that, my friend? Go like that. And fine, fine. There you go, mustache road. There you go. All right, let's go straight here. I like it. And this is going to be a beautiful line because it's going to go right through. I thought for sure I turned you guys off. Sneaky coming back on. I built a line through here. I didn't want you guys to watch the uh, the deletion of the buildings. It was a terrible sight. The protests were real. And uh, trying to keep it light, keep it positive. You guys don't need to see all the... The nasty things going on up here in Madison. No, just kidding, Madison. How we love you. In town, I don't mind if the train slows down a little bit for looks and giggles. And uh, what I have no idea on is what trains we shall place here today. So I upgraded this station, added new lines. We're going to pause right quick. Because this guy... Now has his own platform. Look at that. Platforms for everybody. No need for this signal, but we're going to put it anyway. And I say no need because he has his own platform, which I just said. But I can say it all I want because I do what I want. Anyway, so there we go. Madison's looking good with all the train upgrades. What's cool is this line, new line, can get fed from this guy. So let's go ahead and get a train built. I see this error message. I hear you crying. Uh, but I don't really care. All right. Alco PA, which can go a total of 188 kilometers per hour. Did I build it? No, I didn't. I did not buy it. There we go. Hundred and did I say 88? Yes, I did. All American golden sand. All right, let's let's get quite a few of you. One, two, three, four. Uh, how many do you hold? 19 each. That is plenty for my enjoyment. Uh, let's go ahead and have you go to that station. To that station. And you are going to be green because we like green on these vanilla hills. All right. So now what's your problem? Madison to Vancouver. Too few stations. Okay. You got Madison. And uh, what I need to do here is just go change to track three. I was hoping you'd figure this out on your own. Or is it one? It's one. There you go. You can be yellow. There we go. No warnings. There are no warnings, everybody. Thank you. Good night. Um, no, we're going we're gonna to keep on here. How's the planes doing? We haven't looked at these for a little while. Aircraft numero dos. You look even better with that Alt-G going there. All right. Pretty, pretty cool, pretty cool. What have I got done? Let me look at the list. San Antonio passengers. The Mobile? No. To Portland? No. And to Madison? Yes. I like it. So we've done... Done some things. I see that Vancouver train coming on in in the distance. That's nice. Steaming its way through. I see those... Love bugs. Slug bugs. No hitbacks. All that goodness. So yeah, this guy's looking good. 
Let's watch him get through the town here. And then we're going to go hit up the depot and add passenger lines to Portland and Mobile. From good old San Antonio. We, can, we might see some rough tracks over the roads here because I didn't delete the roads. I just built the tracks over the roads. A good old no-no. I didn't want to delete any more buildings because we care about our past. Anyway, there we go. That's our first train ride through Madison. And then look at all the unsmoothed issues here. Now, I do believe I did not put something here. So, where can we... Where's this guy going to go? Right here. Ooh, good question, man. Hmm. Oh, gee. All right. So what do we have going on here as far as trains? All right. We have visible only. PDX to mobile. I think I'm also going to run um, another line on here. So I'm going to need some more signals. Just a few more. No big deals. And we're doing fantastic on time. I like it. Okay, we got the signals there. Oh, hold on. Why can't I see the... Uh, why can't I see the signals? Oh, there we go. There's signals. All right, because these guys... Am I going to have them share? Hmm. <laughs> Wondering if I should build a, a loop here. Anyway, I think I should for realism. this guy uh, doing okay he's doing he's getting on this line too man we're gonna have a lot of traffic on this line hence all the signals so that's all it's all good good problems to have good problems to have because we're gonna have this guy loop down and around and add on to this line as well so what I wanted to see is the best way for me to get a depot going, but I think I'm just going to have to go like this. A little something crazy, but sometimes it's good to get a little crazy. That's absolutely too crazy and in the wrong direction. There we go. This is the magical train depot that just births trains out of this little tiny building. Alright, so what are we going to build? I was hoping we'd get a new train. Big Boy would be a little bit of overkill. But sometimes a little bit of overkill is good. All right. What do we have running on the line again? That goes to PDX. Okay. It's Hiawatha's. Right, but we're going to go with the Hiawatha. We're going to go with. Hmm. Ooh. That goes 180. We're going to go with the heavyweight parlor. And yeah, we're going to go with that. I didn't notice we have the M-300 right now. We could add a few of those. That would be pretty cool. New line. This is going to go all the way into Portland. And then uh, it's going to go all the way back. To San Antonio. That one's awesome. That's going to be a blue line. Look at that going over that. Turn there. Looking good. Looking good. All right. All right. Okay. So with that one built, uh, we're also going to have another line that's going to be able to take this path and go to Mobile. So let's go by train. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, how fast does this guy go? And it only holds 13. These gas-powered, self-propelled passenger rail cars were nicknamed skunks because people, you could smell them before you could see them. Oh, we don't want to skunk up the line. But man, we're just going Hiawatha heavy. Oh, how about... Oh, I didn't notice this guy down here with all the extra power. Should we just get another Zephyr on the line? Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. I think that's going to look nice. Set line, new line. 
And that's going to go from San Antonio to Mobile. Looking good. And let's get a, a red line. Let's see. Look at that. Fantastic. Cool. That is a lot checked off my list today. Is this the new the new one? No, that's the PDX to mobile line. Looking good. Here's here's our new one. See the full curves this way. That looks nice. Maybe a little riverfront under bridge view here with the plane in the air. And what's great is I can see that Zephyr in the distance. Mobile Crusher. Not the, the anti-skunk, because we almost went there. This one's going to be nice. So then all we have to do now, all we got to do to close out this episode 10, is we got to get construction materials by train to Portland. So we got that. This guy's going to go that way. So let's follow a little river ride here. Boom, there we go. And uh, we have a magical floating locomotive in the distance. Ah, there we go. As we get closer, we render it in. All the new ships rolling, hauling that steel. Probably not steel, but that's all right. And then the beautiful, beautiful land of Portland. Portlandia. Going crazy here. But I'm liking it. I'm liking it all the way around. So this guy... Remember how we were always bringing uh, the construction materials down via truck? What I want to do is make use of another one of these rails here. I've already started building out quite a bit. All right. So what we're going to do is go on beyond this rail. Ah, see, more loopy loop surprises for you. So we're going to go beyond the lumber. And we're going to go up and over the hill to a brand new station that's going to be totally ready right now. Right now. To start delivering construction materials. Just didn't want to do it without you fine folks here to watch it go down. So, with that in mind, I need to delete this. And I want to. Didn't think about this before. And now I am. And I'm lagging it. Is I'm going to put that right there. We're just going to add it on. Clean it up. Probably plant some trees around it because that's what we do here in Portland. And this should connect to one, two. And if I want, it's not a really, that's not a good turn here, but maybe we can pull it off. Yeah, something like that. And something like that. Three. And then I doubt we could oh yeah we'll be able to so if we get this a rolling like this kind of makes it more fun at that crossing as well um here we go like this little little sloppy here probably gonna have to back some of that off back it off for me just a little bit not a lot that's that's not gonna work. What? Why are you going all the way up? You guys. Anyway, I'll deal with you later. You get the idea. We're gonna get that connected to everything. But right now, we need a train with some power. So let's go ahead and bring this guy on. He's got a cableless booster unit B. And then we're going to go with uh, construction materials with the brand new stake car. Construction materials, please and thank you. Uh, and we're going to load this one up. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, uh, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. I want over 200. 
because we're going to set this line new line obviously here and then up there and that's going to be a beautiful thing okay cool so now my idea is because the goods are getting brought in here right right from the green see that green line right there portland goods we're going to expand that because i need more demand on the goods and I'm going to have a goods and construction material train hit up Akron. And it's only dropping off. So we can go like this, buy trains. We have $180 million in the bank. i got to watch out for that. So we're going to go with a big boy. <laughs> Spend all the money. Uh, and then we're going to need to go with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I want to get goods. Hmm, I don't mind that those are automatic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I say that now, but I'm going to change it. Because I worry about it might start moving steel and all these other things. I want this to be specifically for construction materials. So an even amount of both set line, new line. Uh, that guy's going to go from there to there. Cool. We're going to make that one a dark black line. Just so we can see it better on that line there. No path because you got on the wrong track, didn't ya? Yeah, you did. All right. I'm going to fix this anyway. Look at that, buddy. You can get on over and then you can get on over. It's going to be fun. You calm down, buddy. So there we have it. Construction materials going to Portland by train. So we're going to be able to delete the truck line. This is going to be a beautiful ride here. And uh, the big boy in the background, which is looking nice. So we're going to transfer over him through the town. And then we're going to head on back to the Alco. I think we can handle it all without UI from here on out for the rest of the episode. Just to kind of watch some trains go by. And I think that I'm gonna I'm gonna close that notebook. I am that confident that we are done here uh, because we're not. And let me fix that because I didn't think here and go. Hey guys, um, the demand. Come on, transport fever 101. You can't do this, Monty. Uh, no. Construction materials are for... That's the goods. This is going to be the construction materials, right? Okay, so that's going to be good. Where can I buy... Where can I buy a truck right here? Road vehicles. You. The Mac. Just kidding. The Stew uh, Baker. I need you to be getting construction materials. Bye, 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 bye. Set line, new line from here to there, like an actual official truck station, Coolio. And then, just to make it official, let's get everything here. Where, line 11. Line 11. Okay, I like that. Is it, ah, Portland Construction Materials, you guys. I know we're auto-saving. I need you to do me a favor. Um, go away. And delete. Oh, my friends, this was like the beginning of so many episodes. Like, at least three of them. Where we were standing here watching the construction materials go by into Portland. But no longer will they be interrupted by the train service. Just no more, no more, no more. All right, we almost missed it. Our train is heading on up around here. Heading on up. Maintaining its speed quite well. See, and that guy didn't get interrupted. He's going to go ahead and get his uh, lumber log service going for planks. Beautiful tunnel service here. Look at that. We can peek through the road. To watch the train here. Go on through. Can we cam No, we can't camera through that. That would be nice. But yeah, so this guy's going to come on through, pick up construction materials, which we're hoping 
are starting to line up and without the UI I can still tell you yes they are look at that we got the pipes we got the bricks we can build we can build all we want to build my friends so things are moving forward here in Transport Fever Vanilla Hills by the way Transport Fever 2 I'm thinking about a series right off the bat that's gonna be a free play because I'm pretty sure that's a thing still uh, just like this but Transport Fever 2 and calling it maybe Vanilla Valley? No mods? You know what I mean? Kind of same old thing. But you guys let me know in the comments what you think. Ah, oh, look at Portland. It's looking fantastic, guys. I'm really excited with how this is all turning out. Um, really going to start making use of all these uh, new weird lines in our whole new industrial shipping area. Uh, but thanks again for tuning on in for another episode of Vanilla Hills. Appreciate the likes. Appreciate you guys continuing this series. I might be recording it, but you guys are hitting it up on the top of the recording block each and every week, so I really appreciate it. And uh, you guys have a great one. I'll catch you next time. Peace on out. <laughs>